Hey brother, Chair, very wise letter. This is Sung MVP and Chair of the MVP Socialist Caucus. Socialism is not an anchor, it's a rocket. Brothers and sisters, you can take socialism out of the preamble, but you can't take socialism out of the NDP. You're still going to have the orange crunch, no matter what you do. In many ways, this is a peculiar debate. Halifax in 2009 mandated a review of the Constitution preamble. How long did it take to formulate this proposed amendment? And why was the new wording circulated only on the eve of this convention? democratic and more modern expression than socialist when it precedes the word by at least 50 years in history. The NDP belongs to the Socialist International. Does that mean the NDP is going to quit the SI if socialism remains in the title of that international organization? Is this really a motion about modernism or is it a motion about moderation of a diluted message? Let's look at the timing, sisters and brothers. We're living through the most severe global capitalist crisis since the 1930s. Working people are in debt at levels higher than ever. There is a food crisis. There is an environmental crisis. There are wars of plunder and occupation for profit. And some genius wants to take socialism out of the constitution of the NDP? What would Tommy Douglas say about such a proposal? He would say no. So what is the function of the change proposed? I believe it is twofold. It puts a distance between today's party and the generations of labor and social movement activists who fought, scabs on the picket lines, who got arrested, who shed blood in the battles for social justice, for Medicare, for democracy, and for peace. The change would also send a signal to the Canadian establishment. It would say that you can trust the NDP not to rock the boat. But the business media would still call the NDP socialist no matter what. But party leaders would be able to disavow the term. And, party, and, and, the part, and this would deprive young people of an education in the realities of the class struggle on which basis this party was created. Now is the time not to dilute our principles time not to send the wrong signal to young rebels and to millions of disaffected voters. Thank Let's keep socialism in the Constitution and put it into practice. Defeat this